group tutorials can be challenging, particularly if they are a new experience. You may not know the group very well or perhaps not be completely confident about your work. These concerns are common and can be overcome. The most challenging part of a group tutorial will probably be um, sometimes the nerves, I guess, of having you being the centre of attention and having everyone else kind of say how they feel about your work. I think that's probably the most challenging part is just being able to kind of be like, this is what it is, what do you think? I think etiquette needs to be explained up front. And that means not looking at your phone and not being distracted and not um, having conversations. I mean, it's such basic stuff, but I really, you know, I see that and I, I think it's really disrespectful, but I think people don't realise how disrespectful it is. And the quality of uh, people's attention and if they're willing to talk. So it's just really an engaged group that, that all feels comfortable. And I think a way that that can happen is if there's clear guidelines from the beginning of what a tutorial is, how it's going to um, happen, and what's the expectation of everyone. And just that people feel safe if they don't feel like talking, that they can submit their answers in another way, maybe with writing or come up to the artist after. So just some suggestions um, to help people contribute. I think learning how to talk about yourself and learning how it's being made or like how you want it to be perceived is very challenging, but it does get better as you practice more. Yeah. I think what's hard for me in a group tutorial is sort of getting a bit of stage fright and not really knowing how to really clearly communicate yourself and your intent in your work. But I think also getting stage fright as someone giving feedback and not wanting to offend or not wanting to sort of say something really ignorant, not knowing either the practice or the context of the work. So I think that's a challenge. Mm -hmm.